hey guys welcome to my channel how are you guys doing all right guys today we're gonna be making avocado flatbread this is vegan friendly keto friendly low carb friendly okay if you're not into low carb you could substitute your flour for all-purpose flour but for this I'm using almond flour because we are on the low carb version okay so for this you need almond flour which I have measured out half a cup you need flax seed, grounded flax seed. I grounded my flax seed. You need like one and a half a cup of it. Um, I'm adding uh, chili flakes. You can skip it if you don't want. I am supposed to use fresh paisley. I don't really have it or cilantro. I since I have the dry one, so I mean, I'm using what I got. It's too cold. I don't want to go outside. I'm gonna put a dash of black pepper, some olive oil just to coat the uh, the flour when I'm done salt like i said i have have a slice of lemon i'm gonna put a little bit of green chili flakes i really need it spicy it's very cold one garlic and of course the main ingredients which is the avocado okay so you're gonna need like one and a half cup of it and this is a big size this should be enough for the flatbread so let me show you how to put this together it's very easy simple it's yummy and it's healthy okay so let's so go into making i'm gonna cut out the avocado if you have the smaller if you're using the smaller size maybe you're gonna need like three of it this is a very huge size so i'm using just one So to this, I'm going to be grating in the garlic. Garlic is very important, it's necessary for this recipe. Pour the flax seed. Like a teaspoon of salt is fine. The chili, I mean, the chili flakes is really not spicy to me. Some people think it's spicy, but not. So I'm putting the paisley. If you have the fresh one, please go ahead and use it. And a little bit of black pepper. Now you squeeze in your lemon. You could use lime also. And the flour. I'm going to be needing like um, two tablespoons of water. Not now, but after I already mixed it. I'll use my hand, but first let me just put it together with the spatula. You might not even need water, but just because it's almond, in order for it not to be too hard, I'm going to put like two to three tablespoonful of water to it. If it was flour, like all-purpose flour, I don't really have to. I'm just going to make it that way. you think uh, this is making so much noise if you think the dough is too sticky this might look sticky I'm gonna add a little bit more of almond flour same thing if you think your dough is sticky when you're using the all-purpose flour please go ahead and add like a tablespoon for more or you know just you know your dough when you're making it you're gonna see how it feels you see this is going to be sticky because you want it to be easy to roll so 
but this I'm definitely gonna be adding more to it. The the avocado is really big. If it was those small little ones, I don't know if I should call it the organic ones. Yeah, you can't get it so. Look, this is good now. At least I can roll this now. 